Hi, Shea Bear 1000 here and... Monkey 1000. Well, the post office is at it again. We're going to tell you about that. Stick around. Okay, guys. So, ordered a package for Monkey. And not a Christmas present. Just because... I wanted to get her something again another cheap package but so today it was supposed to come yesterday it what it said it was out for delivery yesterday and it never came so today it never came still saying it was out for delivery so I kept checking the mail and checking the mail nothing and here just a little bit ago I've got a Um, what do you call it? Notification here where it says delivered. Okay? Huh. And it says delivered January 16th, 2021, today at 5 29 p.m. Of course, Inverness. All right, so Moo just <laughs> messaged me. <laughs> hey, Moo, you're messaging me. <laughs> he sent a picture. Uh, it's cat loves the box or something oh but anyway <laughs> I, I gave him the old jbc <laughs> camera well it's not old it's actually a newer camera but uh and uh couldn't find the box when he came to visit couldn't find the box i found a box and sent it to him so all right all right so it says delivered in slash at mailbox in Furness, florida your item was delivered in or at the mailbox at 5 29 p.m right there Okay, now I went and checked the, the footage on the security camera, right? Uh, now mind you, the security camera is an hour ahead. I never set it back, okay? So it's going to say 6.58. You'll see me walk out and check the mailbox. But it's actually 5.58. Or It'll say 6.28. But it's actually 528 and this item was supposed to be here at 529 today and as you can see um, you'll see me come out and check the mailbox and come in the house and then I'll even let it you know I'll fast forward up to a couple minutes for you okay so check this out and tell me if you see any any mailman okay guys so here I am. I'm walking out. I'm checking the mail. As you can see, it says 628, but it's actually 528. Just went to 529. Now I sped this up six times here. Um, you don't see anything. Nothing's going on. There's no cars going past. Uh, no mail carrier. I know I just said mailman, but now here you'll see a vehicle. Of course, that's a neighbor vehicle. I've seen it before. That is not a mail carrier. And again, we are speeding up six times and another car, which is just a neighbor car. Now, for the famous trolls and whatnot that my haters that want to say, well, how do we know? Okay, well, check this out. Look at the date, same day. Let's roll this back to 528. 529 okay just in case just for the benefit of the doubt because trust me I already checked just to make sure trust me it's an hour but let's just roll that back to 528 and 529 and check this out okay guys now here it is it's sped up again six times as you can see it says 528 which is actually 428 um, but as you can see there's 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 no no cars at all nothing no one went past even at that time for those of you that are going to think I'm wrong there is one vehicle you will see and right here it is that's monkey she ran to the store and she's coming back from the store see nothing 
So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you in here. I'm going to show you what I mean about the uh, about the time one. I just never set it back, you know, the because it's not on on the internet, so it doesn't reset itself. So I just never set it back an hour, you know, spring forward, fall back. But I'll take you in there and I'll prove to you that it is an hour behind. Okay, guys. So here you can see saturday january 16th it's 42 degrees it is 9 45 okay now this does say 10 well 10 44. see saturday january 16th 2021 so to prove to you that yeah this is an hour behind but anyway that's you know that's proof that they never even went past the house at that time so they weren't even on my street at that time okay so there you go i mean what's going on they weren't even on my street at that time and like i said that i showed you both and i showed you the uh you know i mean huh showed them the video. i don't know why you're whispering you got a mic on too oh. see say something you see it up here hello see but, you know, I mean, they weren't even on the damn street at neither one of them times. So, you know, when it says 528, it's actually 428. When it says 628, it's actually 528. I showed you that. But, you know, they, they weren't here. Uh, I mean, you see me go out and check the mail. They were not here. The package was not delivered. Tomorrow's Sunday, so I won't even be able to call anybody till Monday. And people around here, I don't trust any motherfucker around here, you know, to bring it back to me. You know, if it's on another street over or something. But at the time, I mean, you can see me. At the time that they're saying that that thing was scanned in and delivered, I was at the fucking mailbox. U.S. Postal Service. Yeah. <laughs> fucking assholes. They don't care. They don't care. You know, I'm, I'm about over it. And, and they're blaming the, the COVID? What's the COVID got to do with losing packages and scanning them when they're not even delivered? Hmm. I'd love to see that thing mysteriously go out and show up in the mailbox. Well, I think maybe it might show up tomorrow. Okay, but what I'm saying is, you know, mm -hmm. oh shit, I forgot this, this one. Well, I'll just go ahead and scan it and drop it off tomorrow or in the middle of the night or something. I, I hope I hope so. I hope so. I hope it mysteriously shows up shows up because then I'll go back through I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to set the regular time on that tonight. And then that way I'll have proof. Look, it says it was scanned in at this time, delivered at this time. Why are they delivering it, you know, 1 o'clock in the morning or 7 o'clock in the morning on Sunday morning? How's that possible? You know, it, it just it, take pride in your work. I don't care if you're the post office or if you're flipping burgers at McDonald's. Take pride in your work, you know. Wow. Well. We'll so see if that'll show up tomorrow because sometimes they have that special route that comes around for just whatever important right. stuff. And okay. I think it'll right. end up okay. on that tomorrow. All right, but but my point <laughs> is, is why did they scan it? They're not supposed to. Well, they're not. They're no. not. They're not supposed to scan your package as delivered unless they're putting it in the mailbox. Okay. Yeah, they're not so, supposed to. So that means they, if it shows up tomorrow, then what I'm going to, if I can catch them in time, I'm going to ask them why the hell was it scanned yesterday at 529. Yeah, I would too. You yeah. know, because that, that ain't right. No, it's not. You know, there's, there's no excuse for that. There's no excuse to scan the damn thing and then not put it in your mailbox. So if it went to somebody else's house around here, my God, I'll, I'll never see it. Nope. I'll never see it. I don't trust any bastard around here. You know, they'll just keep it. But anyway, guys, so, yeah, that's my little rant. I'm pissed. You know, this is ridiculous. Twice. 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 And COVID ain't got nothing to do with not scanning it in. No. Has nothing to do with that. You're, or, you know, scanning it in and it not being in the mailbox. Because I've seen our original mail carrier. She's awesome. But I, I've seen her many times. She'll scan it as she's putting it in the mailbox or as she's handing it to me. Mm -hmm. So why would you scan it and not put it in the mailbox unless you delivered it to the wrong damn house? And I, and I checked to make sure that it had the right address. And it did have the right address on it. So 
Not How can they screw up? We have a different guy on Saturday, so a lot oh, of the oh, time. So okay, that's but, probably why. What, he can't read? I don't know. Here's, whatever he's doing, he's doing. Okay. Not our mail lady. No, not our mail lady. I'm yeah. not saying her. I said our original mail lady. But on Saturdays, you know, she don't work Saturdays. Somebody else delivers it. Uh -huh. But, you know, um, say 727... Um, East Ohio Avenue in Lakeland, Florida. Okay, if that mailbox don't say 727 East, whatever I just said, I'm just making something up, you know, as you're looking at it. Huh, oh well. I mean, what the hell? Take pride in your work. I don't care what you say. There's no excuse for something like that, you know? No. Nope. You know, her mom was expecting a check today. How do we know our mail didn't get put in somebody else's box? We didn't get nothing to No. But, which is uh, very unusual. Okay, but what I'm saying is how do we know that all our mail didn't get put in somebody else's box, including your mom's check? Yep. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. and, and, you know, come on. And Well, they say, oh, it was a mistake. You going to pay our electric bill? You know, you going to pay our insurance? You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, no, it was an honest mistake. No, it's not an honest mistake. It's a stupid mistake. If you can't read an address, which I can tell you our, our numbers is four numbers, and the street name, I mean, well, you shouldn't be delivering mail. That's the main thing about delivering mail. You have to be able to read. Mm. And if that number don't match the number on the mailbox, something is wrong. Yeah. You know, I mean, that's just laziness. And in my book, you're a pure fuck up if you do stupid shit like that. If you don't care about, you know, someone else's mail. I seen them one day, they threw it out there on the fucking ground. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, I, I caught them on video. Because mm. I went out and mail's laying all over the damn ground. We called the postmaster on that one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But they never did get back with us about it. Mm -mm. I mean, I've never seen the guy deliver mail again. But, you know, they, they could have got back with us on it because he told us, save that footage. Yeah. Because first they were like, are you sure? And blah, blah, blah. And she said, look, my old man got it on video. Oh, then it's a different story. Yeah. Well, of course. But we seen him. Actually, he, he just went to open a mailbox and he dropped one. You can see he dropped one. He didn't want to get out of his car, so he just threw it down on the ground. Didn't even close the mailbox. Drove off. Mm -hmm. Drove off. Mail was laying all over the ground. Mm -hmm. Stupid. So anyway, guys, so that's how our day went. <coughs> huh. Yep. You know, it's it's ridiculous. That that kind of shit upsets me, you know. I shouldn't have to worry about whether my mail is gonna come to me or not. And then you see these ads on TV where they're setting this box down nice and neat and this Christmas light's flickering and she goes over and tightens it for him and in the middle of the night and yeah, right. Mm. Bullshit. They take pride in nothing. Jesus. So anyway, you wanna add anything? No, I just want my package. I know. It's just it's just something, you know, that I got her just because she needs it and, and well you know, quite frankly, I didn't want her stealing mine, so. Hmm, I wonder what that could be. The thing you was putting in your damn bag the other night, that's for this camera. I put many things in my bag. Remember, I said, give me that. That don't belong in your bag, that's mine. <laughs> that black thing. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So that way she can put a light and shit on her camera, you know. And, oh, yeah. You know, her Yeah, liking. I steal his all the time. And I caught her putting, I say, hey, that goes, because it goes to this camera. Well, you had it to my camera, and I was like, just going to hold on Oh, we was it. just using it. Mm -hmm. And then, so I was like, you know what, I'll just get her one. So I bought her one. <laughs> Jesus Christ, everything I get for it, and they don't want to deliver it. I don't even get It ain't that. like it's a $500 package. I mean, it costs $12.75. Mm. Big whoop. Yeah. And a dollar shipping. I had to pay a dollar for me to not, not to get my damn package. Yeah, right. I paid a dollar for them. Not, you know, fucking assholes. Anyway, anything else? No. Uh -uh. Nope. Freezing cold, but that's all right. It ain't that cold. Where's I just Florida? showed them. 
it's 42 degrees. Well, we're supposed to be down to 30 tonight, but I don't think I'll make it there. No, but mm -hmm. 42 degrees. Yeah. It was a decent day, but it was windy. So hopefully it'll be better tomorrow. So stay tuned for some drone footage. Yeah, we want to get something going as soon as it gets a little bit better, the weather. Yeah. So then we'll continue yep. with our fishing and boating and soon. And camping this soon. spring, hopefully. Yep. All right, guys. With that being said, she barely missed me and the legend. Gone for now. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Monkey. Monkey says she's out for now, y'all. Bye. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.